Barry, say hello to my good friend Sh- uh, Sh- Seamus Tracy from Ireland. Hello. Hello, how are you, Ian? Very well, thanks. Can you hear me? I can. I'm yes, reading from a new thing, County Kildare. Yes. And uh, I just uh, want to say about the Champions League this week, it's, be, it, it, it's been wonderful to see Spurs getting through last night. Yes, indeed, it was. Yes. Now, I'm not a Spurs supporter, but I worked in London back in, in the um, 60s, and I always went to White Hart Lane. Club team that, um, a lot of people won't agree with this. The best club yeah. team that I, I've ever seen, English yeah. club team, has been Tottenham. That double winning team. Well, that they was were that, fantastic that, in '61 too. Yes, they were a good. wonderful team, and it's lovely to see them back again. Yeah. And here they are into the quarterfinals, yeah. and I tell you, they could go the whole way. And I'm going to tell yes. you this: that I yeah. am amazed at the things and these telephone calls I hear from other clubs uh-huh. in England that don't support oh. the English teams in the Champions League. Well, the yes, Premiership is the best. Yeah. Uh, Premier, it's the best league in the world. In the world. But yes, the is, it is. And I tell you, if Barcelona were in it, they'd have a very hard job to win it. Because they'd have yeah. to fight for matches every week, the, which they week. don't do in Spain. They trot around and they just... Oh, it's, it's unbelievable. Um, it's beautiful to talk to you. And yes. it was a great show. And well, thank you very much for taking yes. my call. Thank you. What a lovely conversation that was. Hello. Hello. Is it you again? Yeah. God bless. Bye-bye. Go away. Anyone else? And yep. Oh, hello. Is that you again? Hello. What? Seamus, yeah? Yeah, hello. What hello? can I do for you? What can I do for you? Play for me. Oh, play a good song for me there. Any old pop song from the 60s. Um, let's have a look what I've got here. Yeah. What do you like? Yep. Yeah. Yes. Going to San Francisco or some of them. Scott McKenzie. Scott McKenzie. We've got, um... We've got some Duran Duran. Is that any use to Any song, yep. Yeah. Any song in the world? Yep. Yeah. Well, can you be any more specific? I love, I love music. I used to sing myself years ago as well. No, oh, we never lose the old magic. Do you care to? No, no you're wonderful. Oh, so are you. <laughs> Lovely, the sweet talker. Okay. Yes. Good night. Oh, dear. It's a terrible echo. Seamus? <laughs> Oh, dear. He thought I was you. (laughs) (laughs) Well, 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 that was fun. A lovely exchange of views about Tottenham Hotspur. I I, I did, I nipped out for a quick fag while that was on, so uh, I don't even smoke. No. Say hello to my my good friend Cathy from Hitchin. Hello. Hello. Hello, darling. Oh, who's that? Is that Ian? Uh, yes. It doesn't sound like Ian. Well, I've got a terrible frog in my throat. He's doing work experience here. <laughs> I'm only ringing up to say that mm. when we were talking about um, um, Lenny Kravitz. L- Len- Lenny Kravitz. Yeah. You said yeah. that you thought that he might that he he was born in about 1981. Did I say that? Did I? Very often I say that these silly things. I think he's probably slightly older than that. Because otherwise he'd be about 11 years old, wouldn't he, when he made his hits? Because I remember getting the cassette in about 1992 or 93. The thing is, I had really fallen on hard times doing this job. I used to be someone on telly. I made a rather ham-fisted attempt to get back into prime time telly by doing a silly dance. But the fact is, I've got this show late at night. It's a disaster. <laughs> you, you know. You sound like that, that man that used to be dressed up as a woman. Go away. What man? Um, Camilla Dame Edna. Dame Edna? Dame Edna. 
Yeah, well, I do do that in case I do this show to a one, then I go out dressed as a woman. But then wasn't and Jane Medna the guy that does that thing on Channel 4? Try and sleep with blokes. Sorry, yes, that's right, yeah. That can't be you. Dame but... Edna Average. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, oh when you were saying yes. you've got a frog up your throat... Yes, I up wonder, my throat, I yeah. wonder why earwigs are called earwigs. Well, listeners, don't forget to phone in on 0181 with any thoughts on that or anything else. I'm going to get a proper job now. Not now. Not now. And what about my friend? He can do a party trick where he can stick a condom up his nose and put it straight through his throat.